Jared. What's up? Wanna play a game? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna play like one second of a Disney song. You have to guess which it is. Okay, go. You only get one second though. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Little Mermaid. Oh, Tangled. I can't hear you. <laughs> That's nothing. You gotta let at least one note change. Do it again. I have no idea what that is. Got him! <laughs> So we've been talking about being really busy the last couple weeks with a bunch of work stuff. One of those you guys know about is the website I've been working on. But Cassidy just got her life insurance license so she yeah. can start selling life insurance. I've been so. studying really hard and I barely passed and I was like, thank you! <laughs> because that's a hard test. You're supposed to get 70 and she got 71. So I studied just enough. Yeah. Oh man, it's pouring. Yeah, it's raining what today. It's it like super to? windy super rainy and it was supposed to be nice today but yeah. we're at this place because we've got to finish up a few more things for her license and then we've got a couple errands that we've got to do today okay go 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 we gotta hurry i don't want to get wet it like wasn't raining when we pulled like, up seriously, just barely started pouring. okay should i park over there closer to the door yes where are we already <laughs> back it up oh yeah i got skills i got skills okay go it's pouring i know hurry what my shirt is see-through okay go so, so far I've come up with like a few different little pregnancy hacks to help like save money and stuff. The first one is have your doctor prescribe you pregnancy brain. What's it called? Prenatals because I don't want to spend 30 to 40 dollars for the kind that has DHA in it which they say is important for brain and eye growth which I don't know if it helps that might as well get it. If your insurance covers your prescriptions have your doctor do it and then it's just covered, paid for. Yeah, people might already know these things but they're like pretty sweet to us, so. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so everywhere I've looked, the prenatals I've been looking at with everything that the doctors recommend, like, is like $30, right? My insurance totally covered this, and it's a nice one, so, cool. Check out these clothes over here. That's so cute. Little baby poncho. She'll be more stylish than me. <laughs> and this, too. Here, what kind of stuff do you like? Yeah, I like, cute. I like this. Problem is, is like, most of the stuff, oh, look at these pants. Like. These are for an, that's for an 18 month old. Yeah, that's like Mara. That's a year and a half. Right. Oh, and like these over here too. It's just cute little jeans. Look at these cute little They're jeans. So cute. What does 2T mean? What does that mean? Tall? Tall too. <laughs> Medium? <laughs> tall. tall? Looks like a. We still have I don't a know, lot guys. Tell me. us. Yeah. <laughs> what is 2T? Someone tell us what is that means. Is it two means, toddler? Please. 2T. Like, I don't know, maybe like two years old. But then what's 18? Oh, 18 months. Two. Oh, the next step. But what's the T stand for? <laughs> Should we get you some maternity clothes, Cassidy? Look. They're cheap, like Jared. You. I don't want to pay for it. <laughs> maybe. Yeah, that's working I mean, I'm good. growing pretty quick now, so maybe. So, to answer your question, I like really cute leggings and pants and a poncho was pretty cute. I like more simple stuff. Like, yeah, I don't, I don't yeah, really yeah. like, sorry if you have this, I don't love it. It's yeah. fine if you like it. And like shoes like this. Not my thing. Yeah, I like simple things. I don't like like cheesy just because I don't know I mean if our daughter likes Except it she can this choose though, it like that's hilarious I hope she like gets all sassy in that thing <laughs> that'd be so cute <laughs> Okay, so Jake went and saw the movie It last night and was like excited to see it, but also really scared about it. I think yes, he freaks out. In yeah, he's big. Which is like a real fun reason to actually watch a scary movie with him. But we're gonna go get a red balloon and tie it on his car, and so when he gets off work, he sees it, and then we'll see if he reacts to it. I think this place had red balloons. I don't know. Might take us a little while to find them. We sell balloons. We what? We sell helium balloons. We sell helium balloons. Okay, no balloons here, so we're gonna go to another place, see if we can find them. Whew. Oh, this place will definitely have them, but... Remember how, like, it was downpouring not that long ago? Yeah, it was raining. It's, like, so hot now. We got an hour till he's off work, so... Oh, let's see it. <laughs> <laughs> That's close, You can get those on our eight, and then you can just pick which one you want. And then we'll just blow it there. Okay. Cool, thank you. Right here. 87 cents. Normally we wouldn't spend money on things like this, but uh, it seems like a pretty good cause, right? This is part of the movie, right? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I mean, I've never seen it. <laughs> yeah, I guess that's a good point. Is this to scare someone with that it show? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> Real original, huh? <laughs> oh yeah, that'll work. That'll 
I feel like it. He knows that we love him, right? <laughs> he's not gonna Absolutely. he's not gonna be really pissed. Okay, so we're driving around looking for his car. I can't find it anywhere. I can't find it. They're having a really busy week though. Ah crap! That was the <laughs> it doesn't help also that he has two cars, so we don't know which one he brought. Thanks a lot, Jake. Thanks Jerk. for making our life so hard. <laughs> <Yeah>. Just kidding. <laughs> okay, we're gonna check the Snapchat thing and see if he's actually here or not. If not, we might have to call Colton and ask Colton where. I don't have service right here. Okay, move up. Let's th we still have a couple more rows to check. He's sitting up front, so he can, like, he can see cars walking, drive by. Oh, really? Yeah. So he's probably seen us? Has he said anything? And he probably hasn't seen us. So you don't, you, you see he's right car. here. We just, we just found it. We just found it. Let's okay. do it. Okay. Wait. Was that movie scary? It was intense. Was he, is he like, is really he gonna be scared? Yeah. Film him when you walk yeah, out. Yeah, can you film him? Just like, walk behind him or something, like when you, phone? Yeah. yeah. Let's do this. Don't let go. I'm not gonna let go. Do it on this side. I don't want him to just look out and see it though. And I'm gonna do it like right here. It's probably like some secret though, to where like, the balloon has to be three feet up and we just don't know because we didn't see the movie. I know. Like, we're so original with this idea, huh? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Do you think we could hide somewhere? Maybe if we parked over there? If we parked over there, then we could hide behind Colton's car. Well, what time is it? You have to wait for 45 minutes. No. You don't want to? No, I, am, I have to pee. <laughs> okay. Shoot, 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 shoot. All right, so I guess he uh, knows it was us. Here's what happened. So Colton did end up filming it for us, but uh, I think it was kind of obvious because Jake was like leaving before he was, so it wasn't like natural. It was funny though. He like starts walking over there. And then he like stops. And so you know that like it hit him, like he was thinking about it. But like when he looks back and sees Colton, like it was pretty clear that he knew something was going on, so. Not funny. <laughs> Not funny. Still fun. Still fun, yeah, totally worth it. Anti-climatic, but fun. Yeah, yeah. We'll just, we'll get him another time. How great would it be if we had put one in his bedroom too? <laughs> I know, yeah. Okay, so we've been watching America's Got Talent, <laughs> and Jake just told us how much he loves Mel B, so uh, <laughs> we told him that he should just message her on Twitter. So he's really going oh, to. Oh, I'm doing Instagram. Oh, Instagram? Instagram, yeah, okay, that's where I follow her. What are you going to say? Like, what if she really comments back and says, yes, I will go on a date with you? Like, would you what? drive to California? Oh, in a heartbeat. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this may seem weird and random, but I want to take you on the greatest first date ever. Just what do you say? Yeah, do it. <laughs> Dude. That is so funny. Can we make it a double? Yeah, can we come? <laughs> I sent it. Why not? Okay. okay. I just said red. What if I used my whole life savings to like hot air balloon everything and then like nothing? I mean, if and then she's like, ah, no second. <laughs> yeah. oh. No, she's not even gonna read it, man. There's no way. But like, you actually did it, so that's cool. All and your funny. dreams, Jake. Yeah. Take Melby out. Yeah, let us know if she replies. If she does, I'll cry, man. Let me see this. Pregnancy hack number two. It's upside down. I know. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't matter. Oh, it's yeah. coconut oil. I've been rubbing this on my belly every day, basically. And so far, I don't have any stretch marks. I mean, I can't confirm or deny if it's worked. My belly's only grown this much. I mean, it's definitely bigger than it was, but so far, no stretch marks. Organic coconut oil. And it smells nice. And it feels good. Also, my sister did it. Not with her first. She got stretch marks with her first, but with her second she did, and she didn't get any additional stretch marks. So I don't know if that says anything or not. Comment below if you've tried this and if it works, because I'm hoping it does. So far it has. Or if you have another idea that works too, comment below. Pregnancy hack number three. They say, I don't know who they are, but they say, actually Chelsea told me that she read it in a blog or something. Once you hit your third trimester, get like one item a week that you're gonna need so that you don't have to get it all at once. So far I haven't paid for anything. I've gotten just like a few gifts here and there. So I have like a couple blankets and some things that my grandma's made and just a couple of outfits that I started kind of collecting. That way when the baby comes, you'll be more prepared. Um, if you want to see everything I have so far, comment below. Maybe I'll do like a baby haul or something. Quick fact about Cassidy. Whenever we go to restaurants and we get nope, water cups. Nope, nope, we nope. <laughs>